Hello guys, welcome to the online ITTips.com. My name is Asif Ali. In this video, I am going to show you how you can connect PHP to MySQL. So first of all, you need to open your favorite code editor and uh, make a file .php. So I uh, already opened my code editor namely Sublime and uh, just I write the basic syntax of PHP so let's start to uh, write basic syntax then you need to save the file I can press keyboard control s and I simply enter the file name connection.php then you need to write the code like my SQL connect so first of all you need to connect the PHP to MySQL so you write the uh, MySQL connect this is a built-in function so I just write the comment connect to connect PHP to MySQL and here is a required three parameters so first parameter require your php my admin server name so you just go to your server name i just already opened my php my admin panel and I, I just go to my user account and here is a host name finally last uh, display localhost I just copy the localhost and go to my code editor and I simply paste here then second parameter is require your PHP my admin user name so we will uh, go to uh, PHP my admin user account here is a user name root so I just copy root and go to my code editor and paste here and third of uh, parameter is you need to enter the password of localhost server name and username is root then you need to enter the password so you need to go your php my admin panel and here is the password is no so you need to uh, use double commas that's it so enter the terminator sign and uh, write the keyword echo to display the message I write simple echo uh, and then I uh, write the successfully then I just save the uh, file and I just go to my uh, browser and write the code localhost and here is the tutorials I made tutorials folder and the file connection will uh, here so I open this portion uh, uh, address and I just go to file.php so here is a connection successfully if you want to show uh, message or error as you want to display on your screen because this time I do not use any condition any other uh, message display uh, built-in function so I just here is a here is a correct connection I uh, have made but do you want to enter any wrong information like uh, to or any other value enter here so I just go to my browser and I just refresh the code you can see here is a message display on your screen but here is a another message display connection success successfully so the best way is used to connect the mysql and php so i just tell you how you can do it so i just remove the error 
here I remove the password and then I just write to code uh, sorry uh, built on function to display message uh, or our database is uh, create any mistake so I just uh, like write or die and or die require one parameter so you write the message as you want to display on your screen for example your message sorry your connection is uh, please check the connection save it and go to go to browser and refresh it so here is a connection is successfully but if you enter any wrong information so this message is display on your screen so let's check it I write the number 2 here and I go to simply my browser and I simply search the keyword please check the connection here so another message do not display right so if you want to remove the all hair code only display this message so you need to enter the at the rate swine here and save it and go to browser and refresh the code here is a only display message on your screen right if you want to make uh, uh, connect to MySQL database uh, so you need to write in other way connect PHP connect uh, PHP to database this is uh, all about PHP to MySQL connection code but do you want to uh, connect uh, database to uh, PHP to your database name so you need to enter another keyword like my SQL underscore select DB and here enter the database name as you want to connect the database so I just go to my PHP my admin panel and I already made demo database here so I just uh, write the word demo and I just uh, enter the terminator but do you want to enter this message and this message you can do it for example I write or die and please check the database name and here I write echo right so let's check it save the file and go to browser and refresh the please check the connection but I remove the error here and save again and go to my browser and simply refresh the page connection successfully database connection successfully so here is a two message display on your screen this is a one way to connect the mysql database and also database name but i will tell you how you can do it correctly to connect the database so do you want to uh, create any uh, error here so the same way display on your screen like this I uh, change the database name the database name not available on my mysql php admin panel DER so let's check it to browser first message display on your screen the connection is successfully and second option display please check the database name it means the database name is wrong so you need to enter the O 
that's it i will tell you how you can do it in other way to connect the php mysql perfectly so first of all you need to write the same way write uh, dollar sign mysql connect underscore host and assign the value local host right and second way is write dollar sign my sql underscore user and assign the value root basically the default php my admin um, panel uh, server name or host name is localhost and also you can use uh, the 19, uh, 127.0.0 you can use it but i just write localhost and second uh, username is already default root but you can change it as you want and then the third is mysql underscore password password is already null it means i just write double commas then you need to use the condition for example i write if and parenthesis and I ju just write the um, my SQL connect and here is the three parameters required like and this is the same way so I just write here localhost copy it and paste here and enter comma and then second parameter is copy the second way my SQL username and right here and into the comma and third is php mysql copy it and paste it and use skilly brackets and display the message as you want to show for example i write another way like exit if our message over this process is true so uh, this exit method or message display on your screen for example check please check the connection I will tell you how why I uh, write the this keyword because I use here not equal right uh, I just use not equal not this uh, condition is false so they run this message so I just write another way and I already uh, uh, used to add the red sign because uh, I don't uh, use RC uh, to any other message and then I write the another uh, condition else and then I write again if condition and I want to here is a connection uh, to display to connect the PHP my admin but I use here to connect PHP and my database name so I just use at the red sign and my SQL underscore select db and here is database name i write simple demo and i write the message echo connection successfully and i write terminator and also i use else condition here and i write exit uh, message for example can't please check the connection database so this is the perfect way to connect the php and mysql so let's check it to uh, the this way i open this connection successfully it means this uh, work is very well but do you want to change the any uh, data like I write the 
password and save it and go to again browser and I refresh the code please check the connection it means this message will show on your screen but do you want to change the database name or enter the wrong database name so I just uh, save it and I again uh, refresh the here is a error please check your connection because the connection is false the connection is false this body only display on your screen this message but if uh, this message I just remove the uh, this error so and another error here so this message is passed and go to the next step is else and then show message uh, to here, here please check the database so I uh, let's check it please check the database here a message display on your screen so this is the ways to connect the PHP and MySQL um, I will uh, I have a simple right um, two ways to connect the PHP and MySQL database uh, I hope you are understood as well if you have any question about this topic kindly comment me on below section I will tell you uh, I will con contact you very soon thank you very much for watching don't be forget to subscribe